hello everyone welcome back or welcome um, today I'm going to be doing my Halloween decor haul <laughs> I'm finished done I probably bought way too much stuff but we're moving into a new place and I'm gonna have my own office slash beauty room and um, a lot of this stuff I'm gonna be decorating in there with it so that's how I justified it I also saved like so many freaking Target gift cards to get this Target stuff. So that's a good tip. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go store by store and show you what I got. Okay, so the first store that I went to was Joann's and I just got a few things from Joann's. So they're having a um, 40 to 50% off sale this was a few weeks ago and they were one of the first places that I went to that had all of their fall and all of their Halloween Halloween ugh, Halloween decorations out um, so the first thing I got for the outside door is this little pumpkin sign very cute it's got that rustic look I thought this would be really cute to put on our front door outside. Um, I have like a wreath hook that I can put on the door. Our front door is blue, so um, I thought, you know, neutral colors would look good, and I think this is really cute. Um, a cute fall piece. And then the other thing that I bought from Joann's is a mat. Um, so I didn't actually, I don't have a Halloween mat, surprisingly, I was in the frame. But it's just got the three pumpkins. I can't see if it's showing it at all. And it says, welcome. Super cute. I thought it would be fun for my son James. Because he really loves pumpkins and like jack-o'-lanterns. So, um, yeah. I thought it would be a cute one to get. They had so many different mats at uh, Joann's. Joann's had a lot of really good stuff. Like their door signs and their mats were what stood out to me at um, Joann's. So whether you're into Halloween or just like fall decor, they had a really good variety of both and their stuff was like really really good quality. I also always have a ton of coupons for them and you can use Ibotta to get cash back. So Joann's is a very good place to go looking for your decorations this year. Next, I went to Michaels, and Michaels has some really, really good stuff. But definitely check out Michaels. And they are fully loaded of both fall and Halloween stuff. They were having, oh, I think it was like 30 to 40% off as well. Um, so let me show you what I got. These are items that are not just for Halloween. These are items that are gonna go into my office slash beauty room my theme for it is harry potter and magical so you'll see how these fit into that um but they had these super cute oh my gosh super cute potion bottles bottles so i'm gonna have my bookshelf and my desk in there and i'm probably going to um put them there hopefully you can see that but this one is a love potion bottle instantaneous cures for all afflictions these are gonna look so cute I cannot wait to decorate my office I will be doing an office beauty room tour once everything's finished next month so be on the lookout for that I got these um, flameless battery candles they're black sparkly ones so I thought they were perfect because I've been trying to find black ones like this and I haven't been able to find them anywhere and so um, Michaels came to the rescue got two boxes I guess they're in high demand because they had a ton of orange ones but the black ones are almost all gone I got another little apothecary bottle um, spell bottle whatever you want to call it it's this one it says moon dust very very cute packaging this one has like a little um skull lacy detail at the top but it says the magic apothecary moon dust to soothe the skin i thought that'd also be appropriate because it's also gonna be a beauty room and where i create my etsy products so 
kind of goes with the theme and what that room's all gonna be about. And then I got two more things. My son really wanted to pick out a pumpkin. I always let him pick out some pumpkins. So he picked out this one, which is really cute by the way. This is in like the fall section. The little, you know, typical orange pumpkin, but it has this cute um, gold detail on it. I really love the stem as well. They had so many different pumpkins different sizes different styles and patterns um definitely was impressed by their pumpkin selection and the last thing is this big candle holder <laughs> so my idea was to i don't know exactly how i'm gonna decorate it once i set up my office i'll figure it out but i have these candles that i burn from the little shop of oils they're amazing they're made with like essential oils and they have crystals in them and stuff um but i have like a creative one and i have a few others so i thought it would be cute to set them on top of this when i'm burning them and i'm like creating makeup looks or creating items for my etsy shop so somehow i'm gonna incorporate this kind of you know looks magical and gothic-y so i picked this one up from michael's as well I did not get any items from this store, but I wanted to mention it in case you're looking for stores with really good Halloween decor. Um, Big Lots actually surprised me this year. They had Halloween decorations out before any other store in my area at least, and they had such good quality Halloween decorations. I don't know why I didn't end up buying any there. They were a little bit pricier, that's probably why, um, and they didn't have any sales. But if you're looking for really good quality decor that stuff was amazing and they even had stuff that wasn't just like halloweeny it was kind of like that dark gothic aesthetic so if that's your thing definitely check out big lots because if that's the case it probably would be worth paying the price for them but yeah big lots definitely surprised me i don't ever remember big lots having that good of quality of Halloween decorations in the past. Okay, the next place is the Dollar Tree. So of course I went to the Dollar Tree. Everything's a dollar. They always have Halloween stuff. They had fall stuff as well. But I kind of got some stuff for carving a pumpkin, a jack-o'-lantern. Um, so I got this for a dollar because some of these kits can get really expensive. And then this light to put inside instead of a candle. It's an LED strobe light. So I thought that'd be fun to put inside the jack o lantern this year. I also bought my son some pumpkin putty <laughs> because he loves like slime and putty and stuff. And then this is what I was most excited about the Dollar Tree for. They had these solar steak lights. They have the ghosts. So I got two of the ghosts and then I got two of the witches so cute here's the witch here's the ghost so I'm gonna be putting these outside um, we have a little pathway into our condo and it can get kind of dark at night so I thought that'd be cute for <laughs> this time of year to have them they also had skulls they had eyeballs, I can't remember what else they had, but they definitely had skulls and eyeballs as well. I just, my son really likes the ghosts, and then I thought the witches were cute too, so that's what I picked. Oh, and <laughs> the last thing is a witch hat, because my son always wants me to dress up with him at Halloween, and of course I love Halloween, so <laughs> I, he said he wanted me to be a witch this year. <laughs> So I got the witch hat with the spider spiders on it because I am very afraid of spiders, but my son loves spiders. So for his sake, I got the spiders and the spider webs all over my witch hat. And the last things are from Target. Um, a few of these are strictly like Halloween items. The other ones are not, but they are that magical kind of theme and they are what I'm going to be decorating my office beauty room area with so I definitely wanted to include them because I am very excited and once you see these items you'll kind of get the theme I mean I have a lot of the stuff already that I'm going to be decorating with but 
These are just some of the extra pieces I added. Okay, so my Target did not have hardly anything out. They had a few items in the dollar spot. I mean, a few. And they didn't even have anything set up in the back. Luckily, they had what I wanted in the dollar spot, and they did not have very many left. So either they got bought out quick, or they just haven't put out a lot yet. So the first thing, they have these really cute black fake succulents this year and they're basically all black the plants and the vase and they have this little gold detail around the rim and they had different kinds this was the one I chose they have different kinds of plants I think they had about four different kinds that you could choose from but I have a lot of these succulents I have some in skulls I have one in a little pumpkin that I'm gonna be putting in my office area that I already have but I love everything black so I had to get this black one and it's just so cute I might pick up another one but these are only three dollars in the dollar spot at Target so if they don't have them now they should have them soon once they start putting out all the Halloween decoration then the other thing which was the literal last one in the entire store they have these neon lights um, pumpkins bats and one other one they did not have any bats or anything else they only had a pumpkin one <laughs> and this is the last one in the store so i had to grab it because i knew it wasn't going to be there next week when i went back um i don't have batteries in them right now i think you have to put three yeah three double a batteries in them but it glows neon orange obviously for the pumpkin very cute i've been eyeing this when i saw them on the website and somebody else mentioned them i don't know who on instagram or youtube and i wanted this and i'm so glad i got the last one and i'm very excited halloween or target's got some really good halloween stuff this year i'm not gonna buy anything else like this is it i'm cut off <laughs> no more <laughs> But um, I can't wait till they put all this stuff just to go look at all the Halloween decorations. Target has some of the best. Now let's get into the Harry Potter stuff that I also purchased from Target. The first one is a wand. So you can actually go to Target in the toy aisle. They have these mystery wands. You choose one. You don't know whose wand you're going to get, but it's from one of the characters in the movie. So... I just picked one at random and I'm very happy with the one that I got so if you don't know I took that little test that you can take online to see what house she would be in and I am a Ravenclaw so it is fitting that I got a Ravenclaw's wand so I opened the box and I got Luna Lovegood. She is a Ravenclaw and I was very happy because I actually did want to get a Ravenclaw's wand. Really pretty. These are actually really good quality. Her wand is gorgeous too by the way. But I'm excited I'll be setting this up somehow in my room. So pretty. I'm very happy. I think these are around $14, $15 and to me worth every penny. I am so excited. For my birthday this year, I'm going to Harry Potter World and I have not been yet in Orlando. So I've I've always loved Harry Potter since I read the books back in like middle school. But I'm so excited. Ooh, the next item is a lamp. And look at it. Oh my gosh. It's the Tri Wizard Cup from the Goblet of Fire. Um, and this is actually a lamp, so this is gonna be going on my desk for sure. But it's so cute and detailed. It looks just like the Triwizard Cup from the movie. Oh, I love it. Look at that, you guys. So neat. And the last thing I'm gonna show you that I got is the mirror Woo. the mirror from the movie 
I can never say this right. Um, the Mirror of Arist. Probably not saying that right. There's my camera. But this is the mirror from, I believe it was the first one, the Sorcerer's Stone. And that Harry looks into and sees his parents. Um, so I'm going to be putting this in there as well. I'm so excited. This is very cute. For what I paid for it, it's really, really good quality. I like it a lot. So that is everything from my haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you guys found some things that you like that you're going to go to the store and buy. <laughs> um, really, really good stuff this year at all the stores I went to. Have a good day, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Come here. Come here, bubby. Come show everybody your witch hat on the camera. <laughs> Come sit on my lap. <laughs> Say it. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. <laughs> <laughs>